the most controversial team to hit USWO Wrestling. It's Brian Turner of Booty Call, and you are watching Realistic Fishing. Bounce on over to Brian Turner's VHS Rehab for more of Booty Call. Well, I have a little bit of a problem here, but I think I can figure this out. This old tin fin does not have a ring in the nose. Once again, I'm going to steal the ring from this cheapy cream bait that I got from Walmart for a buck. We're going to put it on the thin fin and see if we can catch a fish today. Let's figure out the best way to do this. It might be with these pliers. It might be with my thumbnail. There we go. Yeah, let's get it on the thin fin. Here we go. Great. Let's get this tied on and see if we can get a bite on this old storm thin fin. I think it looks pretty good. Looks like a shad. Yeah, check it out. Thin fin, patent number D206486. I'm hoping we can get a bite on this today. I want that ring on there so my tight little knot doesn't interrupt the action at all. I'm tying this on with an improved clinch knot. And there we go. We're gonna fish the thin fin. I'm bringing a few pinch on sinkers just in case I need a little more distance. And today I'm fishing with the good old 13 code black spinning combo. This is already a few years old. It's just been sitting around unused. I thought I'd give it a spin today. Let's see if we can get a bite. You know, I can always switch to the Selmo minnow or maybe even a float and a worm if I can't get a bite, but we're gonna see what happens. All right, let me check my drag in case I get a bass or something big. I don't, I don't want to lose. Was that a bite? I don't want to lose my cool lure. I don't know much about the thin fin. I don't know how deep it dives, but it does look good. My name's Emma. Always keep it realistic. It looks good. It looks like a shad. Let's see if we can get something to attack it. It's winter. It's January. Not a lot of fish out, but I do find skipjack occasionally. We can also try down there by the log if nothing wants to go for this. So far, nothing on the thin fin. I don't know if it's too big, too slow, the action isn't right. There might not be any fish around. I thought maybe I had a bite when it first hit the water on the first cast. Now I'm thinking maybe not. It's about the size of a thread fin shad. I thought it would be quite enticing, actually. Right now, they're pretty much ignoring it. Let's see if there are any fish over here. I'm gonna try some different retrieves. Slower, twitching, slower, twitching. I'm just going to mess around with it until I can get a bite or give up on it. You know, pretty much one or the other here. This thin fin, I noticed, floats to the surface when it's not being retrieved. 
I'm starting to suspect the lure is too big and too intimidating. Just a couple more casts now and we're going to try something else to see if we can eke out just one or two fish. I mean, they're not slamming this thing. While I like the look of this lure, it's not catching any fish. Let's try something else, like the Selmo. All right, we're gonna tie the Selmo on instead. See if our luck changes. Yeah, just like that. Let's see if we can turn this trip around. Much less drag. The bait is a lot lighter. It zips around a little bit faster. It's got a more erratic action. Fred Randall. Man, it is getting colder and colder. We're expecting some winter weather. I gotta put my hood up. Come on, we gotta get something. I'm seeing a lot of white feathers float by. One thing is for sure, these fish are not very aggressive today. Maybe a couple bumps. But even the skipjack, which is usually pretty aggressive, even in cold weather, they're not really getting it. I saw a flash, I had a couple of bumps, but they're not taking it. You know, if I tossed a live minnow out there and let it sit and they could casually zoom by and check it out, they might come back for it when they realize it's real, but they're not going for the lures up here. I'm about to go try back down there by the log. Just one, just one fish to make today's trip worth it. When I got here, I think it was 40 degrees. I think the temperature has dropped maybe down to 38. Like I said, there's some kind of winter storm coming. I'm trying to get a few fish before I'm stuck in the house. Come on. Well, the code black is doing well. My casts are nice and long and smooth. I haven't got to fight a fish yet. I might not. We're gonna go with something even smaller. Just a few casts just to try it out. I'll be right back. The last lure I'm going with is a gulp minnow, but it's so light, I'm gonna need to add some pinch on sinkers. There's pretty much no action on this combo, except for darting it around with the rod tip. We're gonna get one down here at the log. We're gonna get two. Let's do this. Oh, 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 that was my best bite so far. I actually felt the fish on there for a split second. Merry Christmas to you. Ho, 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 ho. And keep it realistic. Got something. Look at him. <laughs> oh man, here I am hoping for a 12 inch skipjack. I got a skipjack. What the hell is going on? Look at this one. This one totally looks like a saltwater bait. 
I have lures that are bigger than this. This would make a great bait if I thought there were other fish around, but I don't. Let's let them go. Oh man, that one's tiny. I gotta do it again. I gotta stay for another fish. Even when the fish aren't biting, I'm still out there trying stuff just to see if I can catch a fish. And the answer today is pretty much no. I got one tiny fish. Fish. Fish on. All right. Skipjack, fish number two. I almost gave up, but I got another fish right here. Got him on the gulp minnow. Check him out, about a 10 incher. Big compared to that last one, but there are bigger skipjack in here. I know that for sure. Fish number two, let's let him go. Awesome. Well, boys and girls, I had a rough go today. I did finally get two fish on the gulp minnow. I tried the thin fin, maybe I got a bite. I tried the selmo minnow, maybe I got a bite. But I didn't actually catch a fish until I tried the one inch gulp minnow. It's freezing, I'm trying anything I can to get a bite. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. <laughs>